and I see no reason for hostility between us. Your son can go on calling himself king in the north. The Starks will have dominion over all lands north of Merc Caitlin, provided he swears me an oath of fealty. The hmm. wording of this oath? The same Ned Stark swore to Robert 18 years ago. I mean, that's not a really bad deal. Like, listen, I still think the king, that, that Renly is weak, right? For not, like, being, you know, truthful with himself, at least, right? But that's a fair deal. I'm not even angry at that deal. That, that means that he, for the most part, is somewhat of a diplomat, so. Our two houses have always been close, which is why I am begging you to reconsider this battle. Negotiate a peace with your brother. Negotiate so with Stannis. Oh, that's not going to work, bro. Stannis is the rightful king. Okay, let's just be real for a second. Stannis is also not going to back down. Why would he? What does Renly really have, right? I mean, he has this army, sure, right? A lot of people, right? But Stannis has like some witch or like priestess or something. So, and she just literally birthed like a shadow creature, guys. So, I was, you know, that's what happened. So, that makes me somewhat fearful, to be honest, because I have no idea what really is to come from that, right? So, let's see. Tornado? <laughs> The shadow creature had like a face. The face is uh, the brother. What is happening in this universe? There has to be magic. The shadow creature just walked in and basically deleted Renly. Oh, wow. She's definitely gonna be blamed for it though, most likely. I don't think that uh, Catherine is going to be blamed for that. Run. Time to get out of there, bro. Got to leave. Yeah, you gotta go. They'll hang you for this. Absolutely. Loris. My lord, my lady, get out. Loris was the, the lover of um, Renly. Not Stannis. Right. There's no time for this. Ride back to High Garden, sister. I'm not running from Stannis. You, you should. Murdered I don't believe that. No, she didn't. You'll be cut to pieces before he sets foot on solid ground if it is justice that you want. Be smart about it. You can't avenge him from the grave. Bring the horses. Catherine just said that, or something like that. Do you want to be a queen? No. Hmm. I want to be the queen. I don't trust that. That's Killed. weird. Don't trust him at By all, who? guys. Accounts differ. Some say it was one of his own Catelyn. king's guard. Well, apologies, guys. I was saying Catherine. It's Catelyn. It's wildfire. Wildfire? You wouldn't lie to me, would you, cousin? No. That's a lie right there. None more likely. She's making wildfire. What is wildfire? Perhaps his own unnatural urges would give him sympathy for yours. The Alchemist Guild has been commissioned. There's only one way to Alchemist find Guild out. Alchemist Guild has been they commissioned. They have thousands of pots. She went to meet him. I swear to you. Swear to me on what? On my life. But I don't care about your life. No. <laughs> the light of the seven. <laughs> it will be my pleasure. Well, how do you just say something like that? Grace. What is it? You come to lecture me on truth. I come to tell you that what I saw. All my brother's bannermen have come to my side. Except the Tyrells who fled like cowards. I mean, why would they want to engage themselves with uh, you? I don't know if they know. Well, no. Well, no one really knows, I guess, um, that it was like some random shadow creature that you know decimated Renly. They obviously gave their honor to Renly and decided that you were not honorable enough for their honor. When we sail for King's Landing. As soon as I've consolidated my troops. Okay. We'll make short work of the Lannister's fleet. Once Blackwater Bay is cleared, we'll deliver our troops to their doorstep and take the city. I mean, that would work if the Queen was not, like, secretly working with pyromancers uh, to create some something called wildfire, but I'm guessing it has something to do with fire. <laughs> so, I don't know. We'll see. We'll see how this uh, turns out. And will you bring Lady Melisandre with you? Well, that's not your concern. Some believe she whispers orders in your ear and you obey. She kind of does that exact thing. So when you say some believe, you kind of mean everyone with a brain believes. What do you believe? He just told you. You won those bannermen from Renly. Don't lose them to her. And the other lords won't be happy. Most of those lords should consider themselves lucky I don't hang them for treason. Here's the thing about this very situation. She does have some type of magic power, okay? Uh, so by you saying you don't want her like at some type of battle, 
That doesn't make any sense, bro. I mean, listen, think about it. She has the ability to do things. So hopefully, uh, I don't really like her neither, though, guys. I don't know. I can't explain that. I don't, I don't have good feelings when I think about her. But I do think that she actually has power to do something. So by saying that she can't be there to do her magic powers, then that doesn't sound intelligent, bro. A little counterproductive. Oh, but I do get the other guy's uh, point. Well, now you have to lead the charge, bro. Congratulations. Sister in the bed of kings. Are we yes. surprised when the fruit of the incest is rotten? Yeah. <laughs> yes, a rotten king. I'm not surprised. It's hard to argue with his assessment. Well, after what you did to your birthday present. To the tune of a twisted demon monkey. <laughs> you have to admire his imagination. Right, he's calling he's you a demon monkey, you. bro. Right. <laughs> yeah. Demon monkey. Think wow. Pulling the king's strings. They blame you for the city's ill. He's the only one that has any value in the entire castle. Your captain. <laughs> Don't reckon I've got much use for your ideas on how to do it. Take his head off. And you do this in public, bro. How about you say this in private? Oh, where I can find myself a ship. Take his head off, bro. Remove his head from his that. body. Drag you back here in chains and hang you for a traitor. He personally would do none of that. He's weak. Come on. I'll take you up. Who are you? Doug, man. First man. If the people that he's bringing with him are like that, they don't respect him. They're obviously not like even decent people. They seem to be somewhat honorless, right? Uh, because they're not uh, respecting the overall chain of command, right? So I don't think that uh, it's a good idea for them to even be going with him, right? Because think about it, this guy's super green. All I see is negative influences. I mean, I get it, he's supposed to be, go, he's supposed to be raiding the stony shore or whatever, right? But he's weak, his mind is like, soft and can be molded into whatever they want rather than who he is did they send you, who is he did they send you to roll me out dump me halfway in the sea what i do is they're told what they do is they like and you gave up the starks like loyalty for this stony shore's not far from torrent square okay the seat of the house of Torhart. what you don't think we could take it no we could we can never hold it for more than a few days as soon as Winterfell got word that we'd taken Torrin Square, the Starks would send their men to take it back. And then we... Oh no. Oh, this guy's an idiot. He's an idiot, guys. As long as he keeps winning battles, they'll keep believing he is king in the north. He is. You've been waiting for him to fail. He is not going to fail. And who are the lords of Maidenpool? Remind me. House Mouton, my lord. And what is their sigil? No, my lord. Anyone can be killed. In this show, absolutely. <laughs> no doubt. No doubt. Uh, do not Fresh get attached. Basically, guys, don't get attached. I've learned that early and often, okay? Morning. Was that the guy that was in the, the cell that she let go? That girl says nothing. What? Firstly, how did you teleport yourself? If you could teleport, why were you locked in a cell? Why? Explain that. That girl keeps her mouth closed. A girl. No one hears. It is not for a man to spoil them. Okay. Why are you speaking like this? More of them now. I should have let you burn. Hmm. And you fetch water for one of them now. Right. Why is this right for you and wrong for me? You're both surviving. You're one of them now. But by all definitions, he has to like owe you something because think about this for a second. You saved his life. He is now in a position of power, uh, like one of the guardsmen or whatever. Um, so you can now ask him for some type of, bro, help me get out of here. I need to leave or get me to my brother or something. The red god takes what is his, lovely girl. Red God? The Red God? Is that from the, the Red Woman also? Is that the same God? No, the God of Light is hers. Who's the Red God, guys? We have new, another God now? And the man will do the rest. The man. He is the man? He has no name? Three lives I will give you. No more, no less. And you'll kill him. Joffrey! 
Cersei. The man has said your master's thirsty. What do you he like takes takes their life and takes their name or something, guys? What's happening here? What's the name is gone? What's what's the name is over? They're done or something, guys? It's been a thousand years, but that's the only time they blow the horn three times. Well, if it's been a thousand years, how do you know? You read it in a book. Well, I read, read it, it in, in a book. book. He's not living anymore. And all his pots of wildfire didn't help him, did they? Men win wars, not magic tricks. I wouldn't call it magic. Alchemy is not magic, but I can see how you can think that it's magic. I'm afraid I have to concur with my advisor, Wisdom Halion. Okay. The contents of this room could lay King's Landing low. Absolutely. You'll be making it for me. All right, so he thinks that uh, his sister's plan, half of it is basically silly, right? And the other half of it, he's going to try to, like, make something up. Is that, is that what he's doing right now? Because I'm trying to understand why he would take this from his sister. Other than he has a better idea to use these things. You know, this this, this um, amount of, this, this gigantic amount of wildfire, right? But I don't know how else you would use it. You don't have any other real technology at this time, so throwing it would probably be the most intelligent way, but at the same time, it will create um, fires within the castle, no doubt. He says, laying it low. Let him sleep, Doria. Yes, Khaleesi. I think she likes the dragons more you. than uh, Daenerys does. <laughs> what are they doing? Malako says the statue is too heavy to carry. And carry. Are they trying to rob the place? <laughs> My brother used to say the only thing the Dothraki knew how to do was steal things better men have built. That makes sense. Thing, a demonstration. On behalf of the this warlocks gem. of Karth. Look at it. Into its depths. And you can see yourself. Or you have some, um, so some of your lipstick has, uh, has brushed off onto your teeth. Just letting you know, all right? Just in case no one told you. It would be an honor to host you at the House of the Undying. You are <laughs> always welcome, mother of dragons. Nah, forget that guy. Bad news. 100%. You believe that parlor tricks are magic. <laughs> <laughs> all right. Guys, we've been watching this for a while now. I think he's a little too nice. All right. It doesn't make sense in this universe that there's someone that's that, that is honestly existing and they're nice. A shadow in the shape of a man. It was definitely in status. The shape of status. It was the shape of status, bro. What are you talking about? <laughs> we should reach my son's camp tomorrow. I'm as good as any of them. Maybe. I should never have fled. No. Renly's death was no you should fault have. of yours. You served him bravely. Absolutely. I only held him that once. I only held him that once? As he was dying. Was she in love with him? I, I only held him that once. You have courage. Not battle courage, perhaps, but... <laughs> I don't know. I vow that you shall always have a place in my home and at my table. That's a really good union right there. The boy is just, just cracking <laughs> walnuts in an excessive well, manner. Bro, he's not eating any of the, the contents of the walnuts. He's just cracking them for the sake of cracking them. Lord Stark, Torrin Square is under siege. Torrin Square is barely 40 leagues from here. Must not mean anything then. You're lying. You might be a little old, but don't you call me a liar. What did you see in your dream? Something bad. I dreamt that the sea came to Winterfell. The sea came. I saw waves crashing against the gates. And the water came flowing over the walls. Okay, now this doesn't make any sense, never mind. The sea is hundreds of miles away. Right. See, the first part of it kind of makes sense because of um, what is that guy's name? The guy with the one ship who was just like, oh. If we attack this place, Winterfell is going to come. Technically, they represent the sea, right? They're the ones, they're the ones with the ships. Um, so the sea comes to Winterfell. It, for the most part, it felt like he was trying to say, 
without even saying it during that very exact scene that, oh, if we attack this place, Winterfell is going to come, so we're going to attack Winterfell. So in a sense, that part makes sense, but the rest of it really doesn't make any sense at all. Um, and he's also trying to foreshadow saying that um, Sir Roderick is going to be deleted. Terry to the kitchen, otherwise they'll put but the rest of it doesn't make any sense. A drowned okay. men and... The three-eyed raven. Well, the new wildlings have joined him. From what we can tell, all of them. Okay. <laughs> Well, he has a nice size Rams army then, I'm guessing. Like deer against the wolves. Now he's one of them. Yeah, so he knows how you... He's going to teach them our way of doing things. Yeah. They'll hit us in force. How many rangers can say that? He's the one. Aye. Kill the white. You also let an old man beat your bruddy and take your sword. Exactly. <laughs> but I don't think he was actually trying to... Uh, like hurt him, right? He realized that him doing anything to that man would negatively affect, you know, their situation. You understand that? So he just basically allowed himself to be taken. That's how I would kind of say that happened. Um, so I wouldn't say that he was, he, he allowed an old man to beat him. He wasn't stupid. He played it smart. He's been in love with him. He's not my man servant and he's not in love with me. Oh, he's in love with you. He's my advisor. He, he's in love with you. Okay. <laughs> Even your, guys, even even her brother knew that Jorah was in love with uh, the sister. Yes. I can almost always tell what a man wants. The Iron Throne is mine, and I will take it. Uh, a conqueror. Mm. And how did you get it? And as of right now, I would say though that uh, Daenerys's claim to the throne is much stronger than Stannis's. Right? As the Targaryens, apparently, they had the throne before the Baratheons did, right? So again, it's a tricky situation. I come from nothing. My mother and father never owned a pair of shoes, but marry me and I will give you the Seven Kingdoms. I mean, it sounds like a decent deal. I don't know, I don't trust it, guys, right? I still don't trust it. Now, we need to find ships and an army will spend the rest of our lives rotting away at the edge of the world. Rich men do not become rich by giving more than they get. They'll give you ships and soldiers and they'll own you forever. Moving carefully is the hard way, yeah. but it's the right way. I only want... What do you want? Tell me. Oh, he wants you. <laughs> to see you on the Iron Throne. Why? Right. You have a good claim. A title. Yep. A birthright. Absolutely. I think he's honorable. I like him. For now, right? <laughs> because, uh, bro, I don't want to get too attached to a character because I think that they have honor. Because generally, they just want to take, they just want to make you feel terrible while watching this show, bro. They just want you to take all the good people away. Did you see anything? All right. <laughs> Guys, how they end the shows, a little frustrating. Uh, this episode here, very good, no complaints at all. It's getting better and better and better uh, consistently as we move forward. The woman that is now traveling with the Stark mother, I think that she has honor. Um, I definitely appreciate the way her character kind of moves, right? But I do think that she was definitely in love with Renly. I don't really trust anyone inside of Karth at all. Uh, I think that everyone is shady. Um, more backstabbing, definitely more backstabbing to come uh, is what it feels like at least. But if you guys are following here on Patreon, then obviously you guys are going to, we're going to watch the next one right now. But if you guys are on YouTube, um, the next episode will be coming on Monday. All right. Uh, we generally do a double feature on Tuesday for Patreon um, watchers in full length. So um, listen, you guys all have an absolutely amazing day and enjoy it thoroughly. And obviously, for those on Patreon, let's start the next one. <laughs>